Economics is the use of time and energy. That's what it is. Most people, when you say economics, they immediately think about money. Money is a tool of economics. You can make anything money if you already have the power over people. Economics is about time, the use of time and energy by people. People make the economics. There would be no economics without people. So then it comes down to who are the people who are in charge of the uses of time and energy of the people of this planet. But when it comes to the time and energy of non-white people, the white supremacists determine how the time of a black person, a non-white person, is going to be used and how the energy of a non-white person is going to be used. So that's the economics, that's how economics within that frame of reference works in the system of white supremacy. So the white supremacists are in charge of the uses of the time and energy of their subjects. They also have their own time and energy program, which is what white supremacy. So everything that they do adds uh, is designed for their energy and their time to be used to maintain and refine, if they choose to do so, the system of white supremacy. So that's what that's really all about. Yes. And so they are also the masters of money. Uh, many black people sometimes, I've heard them say down through the years, oh man, I don't have time to talk about all this race stuff. That's a whole bunch of stuff. I mean, you know, I mean, you know, that's complicated and all like that. I ain't got time for that. Just give me some money. Well, money has a source. And also, money has a value. And the value that is put on money is put on, that value is put on money, what we call money, whatever that medium of exchange is, by the white supremacists. Worldwide, there are some, you might say, some black people who say that they have, quote, unquote, sovereign nations, and that they have their, quote, unquote, own money. Yes. But the white supremacists will take a look at that money and say, oh, that's some of you black people's money. You call yourself being a nation, and, you know, you're sovereign, whatever that's supposed to mean to you. It means nothing to me. And that you have your own money. And that doesn't mean anything to me either, because I own you. I own you and your so-called sovereignty and your family and your so-called government and all of your so-called resources, I own them because I own you. I have domination over you, black person. So therefore, whatever you call your so-called economy, I have domination over it. And the money that you have manufactured with your picture on it that says that you are a sovereign nation and all like that and that your money is worth this and worth that, your money is only worth what I say it's worth. I'm a white supremacist. I determine the value of everybody's money. Yes. I even determine what money is. If I say that a quartz rock is going to be the money for the world tomorrow, that you better be scrambling around trying to get some quartz rocks. Because I said that that's the new money of the entire world. Okay. No other money counts. 